In the bigger picture, what sort of things do you enjoy doing? Do you have certain hobbies that you do regularly? Yeah, I mean, sports is massive for me. So cricket, soccer, um, it's been a massive like stress reliever. Just going to, you know, kicking a ball and not thinking about life and university or impending assessments. Getting to really understand the complexity of somebody's life and just working in all those different domains, whether it's their work, their cultural background, their, their preferences, really understanding that individual's big picture, working with them holistically is, is really important. I do feel that my GP treats me as an individual rather than in a generic way. Um, initially I didn't, um, but once I started actually having vulnerable conversations and having those meaningful lived experience being shared, I realised, okay, he, he's actually acknowledging my, uh, my social determinants as a young person, um, the factors that impact me. I find the HEADS assessment tool really valuable because it helps provide a template for me for all the different sections I need to go through. I can work through different domains of their life from their housing, their education, employment, sexuality, their risk profile for suicidal thoughts or, or suicide. And it really gives a sense of, well, this is a holistic picture of this person at this point in time. And very often in future consultations, I'll refer back to that tool and update it as we go. I think it's very important that GPs explore your bigger picture and your environment in your life, whether it's school, university, workplace, family life, relationships. These are very um, integral factors that impact us. So being able to take those factors into consideration rather than you know, a whole one dimensional method um, really does help because you realise, OK, where is the stress coming from? Where is the anxiety coming from? Often people have lots of photos in their phone and they're happy to sort of run through a few of those so that you get a sense of their, their life. And these photos can often be a great um, talking tool as well. They can really open up the conversation.